Hello dear students, I am Prithi Mai. Welcome you all to this video. So today we will solve another competency based question. We need equation in two variable. Just before to starting the question, same thing I will say. First you read the question mindfully, try to solve yourself, pause the video. If you are unable, then only you watch the video to do it, to solve it. It is a question about a moving walk way, which is known as auto walk. It is a slow moving conveyor mechanism that transports people across a horizontal or inclined plane over a short medium distance, short to medium distance. Moving walkways can be used by standing or walking on the on them as part of an algebra field trip Janice, a teacher takes his class to airport to show them to use their moving walkway a demonstration class majors the longest walkway, which turns out to be 256 feet. Using a stopwatch, Janish shows it takes him just 32 seconds to complete the walk going in the same direction as the walkway. Walking in direction opposite the walkway, it takes him 322 20 seconds. It's 10 times as long. The next day in the class, Janice out a two questions. What is Janice's normal walking speed? 3.6 feet per second, 4.4 feet per second, 2.1 feet per second, 2.2 feet per second. Next question is, what is the speed of the walk V in feet per second? 3.6 feet per second, 4.4 feet per second, 2.2 feet per second, 2.2 feet per second, 2.4, 2.4. So you must have seen that walkway on which people stand or walk, they can go quickly or if they are standing, they can go themselves without moving their leg. So this is a slow moving conveyor in the big stations and airport, they are transports people across the horizontal inclined plane over a short to medium distance can be used by standing or walking on them. As part of the algebra field tree, Jenny's teacher took his class to airport to show it. The class measured the longest walkway as 250 feet. Using stop was they found that when they are going in same direction, they crossed in 32 seconds. They are going in opposite direction of the walkway. They complete the same distance in 320 seconds. The question is, what is the genus normal walking speed? What is the speed of walkway? So this question is same as your downstream and upstream. When you are going in the downstream, you add the speed of both to the current. And when you go in the opposite direction, you take the difference. It is the same way if walkway is in the same this direction and people are walking in this direction. So the speed of the walkway and speed of the person is added. When, when walkway is coming in this direction and people are going in opposite direction, here the speed decreases. So here, 
I am taking late speed of teacher the feet per second and speed of walkway feet per second. Then when they are going in same direction, speed in same direction comes your plus y feet per second. Speed in opposite direction x minus y feet per second. So here you have to keep in mind this the person speed should be greater than the walkway. Otherwise, you won't walk when you go in the opposite direction. So x is greater than y. x plus y, x minus y. Now we'll frame the equation. So when they are going in the same direction, so how much time they will take? Time in same direction will be distance by speed. So distance is 256 by x plus y. The time is 32 seconds. And cross multiply like x plus y into 32 is equal to 256. From this, I'll get x plus y is equal to 256 divided by 32. This will be certainly 8. So x plus y is equal to 8. This is equation 1. Second one. When they are going in opposite direction, time in opposite direction, Is distance by speed, distance is 250 and speed is x minus y, x minus y, x minus y is equal to 320 seconds. So this gives you another equation, x minus y is equal to 256 by 320 because We'll cross multiply here 320 into x minus y is equal to 256. So again, let us cancel it. It will be 16, 16, 20. Then I'll cancel with 4, 4, 4, 4, 5. So I'm getting x minus y is equal to 4 by 5. This is equation 2. So now we need x and y. So I'll add the equations. I'll add these two equations. Then plus y plus x minus y is equal to 8 plus 4 by 5. So y y cancel 2 times of x is equal to, we will simplify, it will be 44 by 5. Or x is equal to 22 by 5. So it will be 5, 4 times 24.4. X is the persons. Just Janice. So Janice speed is 4.4 feet per second. Now coming to y. So x plus y is equal to 8. And x is equal to 4.4, so y will be 8 minus 4.4, so it will be 3.6. Speed of the walkway, it will be 3.6 feet per second. So the answer. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing.
doubt is still there, you can write in the comment section. I clear the doubt. <laughs>